Hey guys, welcome to our video. This is John Watts and I am responding to a comment here from the Eddy Matrix. And this was on a video about if you have a default judgment, you start with, have you been served? And so the comment is, thank you for this information and you're very welcome. And video appreciated. I'm not from Alabama, but I'm dealing with the situation from Capital One along with wage garnishment and did not know about it. And a judgment is from 2009. So what I would suggest to you is first look and see if you can find a lawyer in your state. And I'll put a link below this comment. And it's an organization that I'm part of, National Association of Consumer Advocates. And it'll be a link to find an attorney. And you just go there, you put in your state, maybe you can put in your city, I'm not sure, but I would just start with the state, kind of start broadly. And then it'll give you different options for types of law, it might be class actions or credit reports or whatever. And I think what you would want to look for is there should be something called debt collection or collection lawsuits. And just find some people in there in your state and call them or email them and say, hey, here's my situation. I have a judgment from, I think, 2009, Capital One. I didn't know about this lawsuit. Can you help me see if I have the basis to attack this judgment for lack of service? So that would be one thing. Now, you could also go to your court and ask to see the file. And usually they're pretty nice when you go into a clerk's office and just say, hey, uh, I've, I've got this case got this judgment. Can you show me where the information is about me being served? So it might be a piece of paper that is from the sheriff's deputy or the private process server, or it might be a green card, certified mail that you supposedly signed. And so try to gather that information. And so that's what I would start with. And look, if you were served, then, you know, you need to talk to a lawyer and say, okay, well, how long can they collect? Is there a time limit in my state? Uh, what are my options to settle this with monthly payments? What are my options to do a lump sum money all at once? Or should I look at bankruptcy? You know, just figure out your options. And so that's what I would do. So if you are properly served and you can't attack the judgment, cannot attack the judgment, I would look at those. If you can attack the judgment, then that's great because you know, as we've talked about, this judgment sits on top of being served. If you pull out the serve, the judgment falls apart. And now Capital One's got a litigated case against you from 2009, where you probably supposedly defaulted in 06, 07. Maybe they have all the information or maybe they don't. So I hope that that's helpful. And thanks for watching this video. And uh, thanks for leaving the comment. Have a good day. Bye-bye.